women's rights, not the women. I'm fighting for the people who are being violated. <sighs> you know, the peop I, mean, I know that you could say the fetus is being violated, but the fetus is an unwelcome guest in a lot of, a lot of cases. In a lot of cases, you just fucking went on a rant for two minutes and 32 seconds where you just said that it's... All human life is bad. Except for people that think like you. God, no wonder you won't fuck your wife to give her a child. You guys have been married for five fucking years and she probably wants a kid from you and you won't even fucking procreate. You're like the fucking panda of human beings. Pandas are nice, fluffy, and cute. But guess what? They're the dumbest animal on this planet. They won't fuck to save their species. You won't either. So you gotta realize that. If you guys do figure out a technology where you can remove the, um, the fetus without damaging it, you can grow it yourself. Oh my god, I was right! Raise it yourself. Awesome, I support you. But right now... We human beings don't have that fucking technology! You know, we, we've tried. We've honestly tried. It's called a test tube baby. But you know, some of them come out really fucked up. The majority of them don't, but the few that do... Oh my god, you would never want to raise that. It looks like a fucking potato with a face in the middle of it, with leg stubs. <sighs> You are literally uh, insane. Looking is it's either, you know, she has to spend the next 18 years of her life looking at a rape baby or, you know, she could die because of this pregnancy due to a uh, deficiency in their, their family line, you know. You know how rare that shit really is? I mean, like, how fucking rare a deficiency in the family line. You know, what, what, what century or, you know, what decade are you living in? Is this 1968 where we haven't gotten all the, all the science and medical technology that we have now? Are you one of those fucking people that think we never derive any data from animal testing for medical bi and biomedical science? I'm talking to a person on a MySpace IM who's going to go nameless just for the sake of anonymity. You know, you don't need their identification out there. Who could have died from their anemia, from arthritis that they've contracted in their teen years. It's the medical advances from the fucking animals you think are being tortured that are keeping this girl alive. Fuck you, Greg, you unhumanitarian, stupid cunt suck. I can't believe people like you are literally alive in this world. You are fucking dumb. You're fucking dumb. Every single fucking one of you dick suckers that is going to comment and downrate my video, you're fucking stupid. You're a bunch of fucking apes. Every single last goddamn one of you morons. Every single fucking one of you people. You've never fucking lived through anything. And you're gonna tell me that I'm a stupid bastard for thinking that he's full of crap. I've got a fucking two-year-old daughter of my own that I take care of. Guess what, you sons of a bitch? I fucking brought that girl into the world. She could have died. I know the sanctity of human life. My ex fiance didn't want her. She tried to kill her with drugs. I'll put... If you ever saw a picture of my goddamn girl and you fucking try to justify somebody killing her with drugs, you're a fucking madman. You're fucking crazy. You're making me all riled up and you're going to make a bad example out of me? Fuck you. You value nothing. I'm not even going to finish your fucking dumbass video. I don't want to hear another word out of your fucking mouth. I Actually, yeah, I do. I want to see what your follow-up to this is. You fucking childless hack. You fucking childless, experienceless hack. Fuck you.